Fox Forecast Center is tracking the potential for a rare subtropical storm that could form as we head into next week. Now, if this does form and get named, this would be the first time ever we've had a tropical system form in the Gulf in the month of April. We have had some tropical systems in the past in April, but they were way out here. They were not in the Gulf. Regardless of whether or not it gets named, it's really just a technical definition here. You're still going to get a whole lot of rain, and Florida is getting in on this, which is great news. They're under a severe drought. Even one to two inches for most of Florida is still good. Is it a drought buster? No, but is it going to help? Yes, absolutely. Portions of northeastern Florida and the Georgia coastline could see as high as three to five inches. Keep in mind, this is over the course of the entirety of next week, Monday through Friday. But still, and then keep in mind for the Gulf states, the ground is completely saturated there. Does not take a whole lot of rain to get flash flooding. And we have a lot of rain on the way for next week. So there are some flash flood concerns. So here's what we know. A weak area of low pressure may develop into the northern Gulf Coast. If this low pressure system develops ever so slightly to the southwest, it's going to encounter even warmer sea surface temperatures, which would only work to rise the chance of seeing that tropical development. As of right now, the sea surface temperatures are what we call marginal. They're in the upper 70s, so it could be just enough to get that development. Regardless, again, Rain and some flooding is likely. We have this dip in the jet stream. This is going to create what we call a jet streak over the Gulf. It's really just an area of the jet stream that's faster than other areas in the jet stream. And what this does is it creates that low pressure system. Now I want you to look here at the sea surface temperatures. I mentioned if it slides ever so slightly to the southwest, it encounters that warmer water. 80 degrees is what we like to see in terms of sea surface temperatures to get that tropical development. And we do have 80 degree water just off to the southwest. As of right now, the water that's over the low pressure system where it's likely going to develop Stephen is upper 70 so it could happen we'll be watching it I'm Amy Freeze welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page we have more great videos on the way so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather